Oh wait, 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 sorry. No. We just got a little bit lost. This is day one of my vlogs and uh, and right now it's 6.15 a.m. Uh, I'm just doing some reading, reading, skin in the game. I'd highly recommend it. But today we are going to do a few things. It's super early, so we're going I'm gonna go to the gym and then I'm going to go and check into a new apartment that I, uh, I'm checking into for the next month. So that'll be good. And then I'm gonna go and check out this place called Design Hub. Let's get into it. All right, so here we go. Oh God, it's raining. Okay, so we're just gonna walk around to the gym just now. I just arrived in Kampala, Uganda. Um, I, I was in the States, I was in Louisiana visiting my brother for Christmas and New Year. Then I just decided at the last minute that I was going to book to uh, to come to Uganda. I was actually meant to be working all of this year, but it seems like that's fallen through. So um, I'm not sure what I'm going to do next, but uh, that's actually quite exciting in a way. Uh, I'm looking forward to, to just spending a lot more time making content online. Uh, I've, I signed up yesterday. So that's the sweat session over. Now we're going to go and check into my other uh, apartment. So looking forward to showing you guys it. Today's pouring with rain. It was so hot the last couple of days. These guys are uh, boda boda. These guys basically just carry people around. Super cheap. It's like. 3,000 Ugandan shillings to to get pretty far and that's about that's less than one dollar so yeah these uh these boda bodas are pretty dangerous but they'll uh they'll get you around town pretty quickly and there's usually guys you don't need to book them or anything because there's so many so many guys kicking around and all you need to do is uh give them a wave and they'll come pick you up so pretty good got a little bit lost there. I went one street over, so just walking back. Is this the place I'm looking for? Yeah, I came here to view the place a couple of days ago and uh, it looked alright. I mean, it's on a pretty rough road. So, take a look at the road. Uh, better clean the lens, hold on. There you go. There's my road. <laughs> it was worse than the rain. Yeah, so uh, I came to see this place yesterday. I found it on the internet. Messaged the lady. Looks nice. I'm going to go and give her cash. Um, she's actually got a dollar account, so I'm just going to give her the normal exchange rate. I think it's 3,500 Ugandan shillings to the, to the dollar. Um, around that. They actually give you around 3,400 when you exchange $100 bills and $50 bills. And for some reason, when you exchange $20 bills, they only give you 3,000, sometimes 3,050. So yeah, oh, I'm gonna get caught up. Everyone always looks at you when you've got the camera. The other thing is if your notes are just a tiny little bit torn or they've got any marks on them, the bank might not accept them, so people are really reluctant to take them, so they end up giving you less. I've got some dollars that I'm going to give to charity. Uh, no, the lady that's renting the place is called Charity, so 
Yes, so she said she'd accept dollars, but we'll see whether she accepts the ones that I've got because they're not in perfect condition. Otherwise, I'll give her some shillings. Um, but I might be able to avoid the exchange uh, issue. So, see whether that works. I'm also hoping that they have a driver that can take me back to my place and pick up my stuff. Because these Boda Bodas, you can't really take much luggage on them. Alright, so this is the gate. I'm just waiting for for Charity to, to arrive. She's, uh, she'll be here soon, I hope. Hello. Huh? Okay, okay, thank you, thank you. Okay, so one of the building managers is, has come to save the day, which means I could stand inside because it's pouring down with the rain. Hey. Did she tell you that she was coming? Hmm. I don't know where Charity is, but Derek, her colleague is going to come here and meet me and, uh, and he's going to let me in and take the money and then we can get on with the day so just waiting for him he'll be here in a few minutes and then we'll be good to go oh I better take my shoes off as well nice nice yeah I've seen it already so cool There's the room. Not bad, not bad. There's the bathroom as well. It's all right. And then it's got a kitchen area, and then it's got the living room that we saw already. Okay, so all checked into the apartment. We're just gonna go and pick up my bags from the other Airbnb that I had, and then we're good to go, but happy to be settled in somewhere. Definitely one month. I have a three month visa. Oh yeah. So, I'll extend. <laughs> yeah, I might extend. When you like it, you just extend. How long have you lived here? Oh, oh no, I grew up from here. You grew up here? <laughs> yeah. I know the design hub. This is design hub? I don't know what this is going to be like, but let's check it out. So yeah, this is like, uh, it's like we work basically. It's like uh, hotspot spaces for people to come and do work. And then there's loads of different companies here doing different activities. It's also like uh, private offices in here. And then they've got this large space for doing, doing massive events. It doesn't seem to be that many people here at the moment. I don't know, it's Monday morning. You probably expect people to be up and buzzing and ready to be working, but it doesn't look like it's fully going yet. I mean, it's still early. I'm here at the design hub. Um, I don't know, man. I think I'm gonna check in a few times a week um, and come and meet some of these companies that are working from here. But. I don't think I'm going to begin to stay here. They, they showed me some of the offices and they look, uh, well, it's just pretty basic to be honest. I mean, it's like a, it's like a warehouse in the middle of, uh, middle of Kampala. They do have mango juice though, so that was good. I got one of those.
check sugar is. Okay, hard labour breakfast. I'm vegetarian, so that's not for me. French omelette. Mmm, that does look good actually. Triple. Mm, I think it's between the shakshuka with feta and the French omelette. Decisions, decisions. favorite road in Uganda that's the end of today's vlog so yeah if you like the vlog please hit the subscribe button and the notification bell and like this video and uh, I'm gonna be doing some more exciting activities here in Kampala there's there's you can go on you can go on Lake Victoria on a boat and there's loads of activities to do here so I'm gonna be checking out some of those during the day and then I'm going to be making uh, some videos um, in the evening and uh, I hope you like some of the content I'll be making over the next few months so thanks for tuning in.